Hello friends, Kisani ji here again and welcome you in this video tutorial. In this video tutorial, I am going to talk about the next set of default method in map interface. That is the part of the JDK 1.8. So let's press Ctrl Shift T and try to search for the map. Right, so this is the map and here if you look in press Ctrl O then you can see the list of methods. So in previous video tutorial already we have gone through the first two method get or default or for each loop in this video tutorial let's talk about the next default method that is called replace all so you can see the signature of uh, replace all it's except by function parameter right and you can look into the java doc saying that replaces each entry's value with the result of invoking the given function on that entry until all entries have been processed the functions throws an exception exceptions thrown by the functions are related to the caller right so here whatever value is evalu evaluated by the by function method so that value is getting uh, e every value is getting replaced by that so let's try to understand through an example so here i'm gonna create a map and key and value at this time i'm going to take at integer itself so key and value integer I would see uh, a map equal to new hash map. So here you can take any implementer of map interface. And now I'm going to add map as a put method. So you can uh, specify two as a key and value as three. Similarly, I'm going to put I'm going to add some more methods or what I'll do let's keep key as a double and value is also a double so if you see double then you will have to give point zero something like that so point zero now key over here I'm going to three point zero and three point zero again two point zero and 4.0 so for uh, keep this demo sweet and sweet and short i'm going to add only these three elements now let's try to make use of replace all <coughs> now replace all takes by function as an argument right and whatever value is returned by this by function all i mean value in the map is going to replace by that so let's select replace all and, and here as we know that by function is a functional interface so uh, it is having only one method so if you look into the uh, by function interface then by function has a only one functional interface is called apply so you can apply i mean uh, business logic on these two uh, inputs and we'll get you'll get the final output as a r so so apply method for apply method we can write a lambda expression right so say now suppose first key is n1 and value is your n2 then n1 comma n2 and let's say uh, lambda expression and i'm going to use a math library math is having a power method right so in power except two parameter parameter a and b so so uh, n1 comma n2 so basically what i'm trying to do over here uh, here key is the 2 so just i want i'm um, value is the 3 so i want to calculate 2 the rest to 3 or 2 to the power 3 here 3 to the power 3 2 to the power 4 and uh, this function will calculate 2 to the power 3 and this value it will be replaced by that evaluated value and after doing this after applying replace all method if i try to map if i try to iterate this map using for each loop which again accepts a by function interface so here we can make use of the lambda right so i would say suppose x comma y and let's write a lambda for this and you can print uh, x is nothing but the key itself k 
key in the map and y is the value itself in the map and if we try to print so let's see what output we get so if I run it then you can see so first 2 raised to 3 right so uh, there was supposed to um, 3 values why I am getting 2 so let's see so I was supposed to get 3 values right because we have uh, 3 entries right I don't know why this guy is behaving like this so for first uh, 2 raised to 3 it's, uh, that was supposed to give you 8 3 raised to 3 27 and 2 raised to 4 ok sorry so what happens here we have given the key right key um, we have given the duplicate key right uh, 2.0 is key over here and here is also so this last value is getting overridden right so in map you cannot uh, specify two keys with the same value right so that's why we are getting output for the last two entries right so 3 is to power 3 that is uh, 27 and hash map does not maintain the order so that's why order is getting shuffled and if you look into the order then for key value I have given 3 and here again for key uh, 2 I have given the value 4 so this output you are getting right 2 raised to 4 that is uh, we are getting the value as a 16 right so I hope you understood how to make use of the replace all method now next in this list if you go to the map interface uh, we have uh, something is called put if right put if absent so if you look into the java doc saying that if they specified key is not already associated with a value is mapped to null associ null associates it's with the given value and returns null right if you specify so let me try uh, i have a previous example so here uh, i have a key uh, this map i had created an earlier example so let's paste over here and here what i'm trying to do so in this map i would say put if absent right and key i'm going to specify it uh, 1001 and value i'm going to specify as a sign right and if you look into the sorry so key i was specified I, I was supposed to specify as a integer right so now if you look into the output of this guy so say result so you can see here in this map i mean this you will not find i mean 1001 as a key in this map right so sam will be added and this result will be returned to you so if you try to print value for result then this will return you the sam itself right so let me show you so that so okay so this sorry so this key is not present in this uh, uh, map so initially that returned you null right and this has been added in the map if you try to retry uh, its value by this key 1000 and th then you will get right if i pass sorry integer 1001 then this will return you the map right because in this line what happens this key is not present in this map so this key value pairs is added in this map right and this will return you the because this key is not present over here so that returns you null if this key is present in this map then uh, value if you are specifying the new value that value will be substituted and that will return a, a corresponding value to you now if I run it then you will get uh, finally you got the SAM let's try with the some key which is already present in the map if I try to add now map dot set put if and let's choose some existing key so I'm trying to add a value with this key which is already present in the map 
and say kk right and if you try to say result 2 and try to print it and again in next line I try to retrieve value for this key then see what output we get now let's try to run now check it out so these two output from previous uh, method right replace all uh, we have seen for this this output we are getting so let's separate these outputs and let's try to run it again so here let, let's start from this SOP so here what basically we are trying to do in map we have we have used put if absent so this key is absent so that is getting added and that returns you a null now next line when you say emp.map get and you are passing this key so this entry is already has been added into the map so that corresponding value is returning uh, getting returned to you right so that's why we are getting the sand in next uh, look at here so this key is already present in the map and corresponding value is frank so what happens so this value is getting uh, returned to you right frank and when i try to retrieve then corresponding value which was already earlier right so that is getting returned means in this line uh, that value is not getting replaced right so if key is present so this value will not be added right so same value is getting returned to you so that's the significance of put if absent so uh, while looking into the method name itself saying that put if absent so this key is absent then add it and return it null and next line when you try to get with uh, this key then this will return to you again i what i have done emp dot map map uh, emp map dot put if absent so this is not absent right so nothing will happen so corresponding value frank will be returned to you and again you try to get the result this result try to print then you'll get the frank itself whatever uh, i have added over here corresponding to this key that's it that is getting returned so i hope you understood these two api so first one replace all and second is the uh second is the put if absent so if you look into the map interface there are still a lot of default methods are pending which i'm going to cover in next series of video tutorials so up to here we have covered in next video tutorial i'm going to cover next uh, uh, pending API so please be with me over there and thanks for watching this video this code I am going to upload on the github so that you can download and run on your local machine so thanks for watching this video and uh, git, github link you will get in the video description itself so thanks and see you in next video tutorial